everybody, it's Aaron with Defensive Concepts and Solutions. I want to show you another uh, alternative uh, weapon retention. Uh, this is from a um, situation where the bad guy, for whatever reason, they're kind of not on their A game, and they decide to grab your weapon from a weak side position, like Mr. Geiger's going to do here. Uh, the chance of them doing this are unlikely, but it's still possible. Okay, let me back that up a little bit. Let's go ahead and, so if I'm in here and he makes the initial grab, fundamentally, Things really haven't changed from the last video. I want to clamp down on his wrist, and I want to squat and take his center of balance, okay? He's weak, I'm strong. Deliver a palm heel strike. Then I want to step into him. Nothing says this isn't uh, necessarily a knee strike. It can be to the groin. I want to come in here, and I want to take this hand and try to feed it underneath and pop my wrist so I can acquire his wrist, okay? And then the idea here is I'm going to spin around and pin this behind his back, all do -si do with Mr. Geiger here. So we want to end up something like this, okay? This is pretty strong for me. If I really wanted to be mean, I could go into a series of strikes from either side, and I could take him to the ground. The problem with this particular technique is it does have some uh, deficiencies. Go ahead. He grabs, I'm here, I'm here, okay? When I come in here... If he's really strong, I'm not going to be able to pop his wrist, and he's going to keep it glued to me here. Plus, he could bear hug me, okay? If he's a good wrestler, now he's got my back. We don't want that. So if I can't get anything here, nothing says I can't start feeding him, I don't know, 10, 20, 50 elbow strikes, and then try to disengage something like that and create distance and then go to whatever weapon system I feel is appropriate. So I'm just kind of showing you some different concepts here to kind of play with and put in your own arsenal. That's pretty much it. Train hard, fight easy.